Praise the Lord. I am Ria Lang from St. Benedict Mission, Birmingham, and in year six. Hope all of you are keeping well with the grace of God during these difficult times. With schools closed, we have nothing to do and nowhere to go. Hence, we have a lot of spare time in our hands. Most of us spend this excess time on video games, social media, and binge watching videos. So I have decided to give this up computer games as I spend as a Lenten sacrifice. Lent is a time to get closer to Jesus, as he felt like this when he was in the desert for 40 days and 40 nights. We are also tempted the same way Jesus was tempted three times by Satan. The devil said to him, if you are the son of God, command these stones to become loaves of bread. However, Jesus refused these temptations. The three main things we are to do during Lent are prayer, fasting and almsgiving. These are also signs of what Jesus did and how we are to follow his footsteps. The colour of Lent is purple, associated with mourning, which anticipates Christ's pain and suffering on the cross. And royalty, which celebrates Christ's resurrection. The tradition of the Lenten sacrifice has its roots in Jesus fasting for 40 days in the desert. Lent is not about how big the sacrifice may seem for others. However, how big the sacrifice is for you. The concept of Lent is about what Jesus has done for us when he fasted in the desert for us and the sacrifice he made himself. Our sacrifice does not have to be as big as abstaining from food and water. When Lent is over and Easter Sunday arrives, the faithful are able to indulge in what they sacrificed during the Lenten season. During Lent, many people decide to give up something that they are addicted to, perhaps chocolate, sweets, or using technology like I am. Others might decide to take up something like helping out more at home or making an effort to go to Holy Mass more often. So far during Lent, I can notice many benefits. These include having more time walking with my family, helping my mum around the house and learning various different skills. These advantages provide me with significantly more happiness than playing video games. I have already completed two weeks of the sacrifice and hopefully the, with the power of God, I'll be able to carry this on. In conclusion, Lent is a time for reflection and remembering the sacrifices Jesus had made for us. I want to thank the Aparki for this opportunity and everyone who organised this. Thank you. Thank <laughs> you.